Hello everyone, and welcome to Pen and Pen Blades. Today, I'm going to be taking a look at two pens and a knife that I got in the mail today. And we're going to start with this one first. Here's the packaging. It's a Retro 51 rollerball pen. Let me just take the plastic wrap off. Alright, there we go. Got the plastic wrap off. So, this is the box. It's the roll above the Corsair F4U. Let's take it up. It's the inside of the package. Let's see what this says. Fine ring since 1990. It's just. Okay, that's just some information about Retro 51. Let's take a look at this pen. There we go. Look at that. So this is a rollerball pen. This is a twist mechanism. Okay, I'm back. Just wanted to get went to get some paper because I have never tried a rollerball pen before. That's nice. It's really nice, nice black ink. There's one more look at the pen. Nice. Alright. Now, next, we have the P51 Mustang. Same thing, just different artwork, different plane. Now, this one, this one is a fountain pen. This one's a little. Came with a converter, so you can put ink, bottled ink in it. It's nice. And there's the pen. Yeah, I think, yeah, it's a screw off cap. There's the nib. It's a one, I believe it's a, let's take a look at that. I believe it's a, yes, it's a 1.1 stub nib. Yeah, it's got a nice weight to it. It's a metal body, metal cap. Um, one second. Okay, got it. Feds are just a little tight. I'll take the pen off. There's the nib section. And inside, they have two standard international cartridges with, I believe that's black ink. What does that have to say? Yeah, that's so the pen comes apart. Screw it back together. Oop. A little squeaky. And then the cap. Screws back on. Just like that. That's pretty cool. Look at the detail in the, in the pen body there. Little rivets, or meant to look like rivets on the plane. Yeah, it was really cool. All right, now for the pocket knife. But before I do that, I just noticed this on the back of the Retro 51 paper here. It says, "Life is too short to carry an ugly pen." I just thought it was, <laughs> thought it was kind of funny. Yeah. All right. So this is a frost cutlery uh, muskrat. I believe. And I bought this off of eBay used. Let's take a look. Got the okay. oh, I guess I should have let you look at the boxers. Not really familiar with frost cutlery, so I couldn't tell you really anything about this one. This is my first frost and my first muskrat. Let's take a 
Okay. Oh yeah. Look at that. That looks nice. I believe the handle material is called burnt bone. Yeah, maybe a little, little uh, joints are maybe a little gritty. Oh yeah, that's gonna need some oil. Yeah, nice. That's a nice size handle. Pull out both of those blades. Again guys, this is just going to be a quick video, I'm going to show you what I got in the mail. So until next time, this is Pen and Pen Blaze, keep your pens filled and your knife sharp, I'll see you in the next one, bye. Got one more quick thing guys, Before after I shut off the video, I was messing with this blade, and that thing is quite stiff and gritty. And it doesn't even have any spring back. I don't know if you can see in there. Is it closed? There's some some white stuff down there. Look what that is. If anyone has any suggestions on how to clean this out, please leave them in the comments. But that's it for now for this video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.